Colo, disappointment today. Can you sum up what went wrong out there? Yeah, very disappointing. Um, it's a it's a quiet dressing room. It's a dressing room knows that we are uh, we weren't at it today, and and we got punished by um, by a fleet routine that I think on the day we're, we're better than us. And uh, uh, yeah, disappointing. But we uh, we we've got to pick ourselves up now because we uh, we've got a massive game next week at Peterborough, and I think um, I think they won today. So we need to uh, make sure. We have a good week on the training ground and uh, and we're, we're back at it um, next Saturday. Are you able to put your finger on sort of why people weren't at it today or was it just one of those days? Yeah, I think I think we've got to give credit to Fleetwood. They um, they come with a game plan and they sort of beat us up all over the park really. Um, they had um, a, a, a physical presence at the back and they had a big lad up front and um, I think they had a lot of energy in midfield as well and I think, I don't know what it was, it's just... We had an off day today and they, they capitalised and they were I think they were better than us all over the park today. As you say, a full week on the training ground, you must be looking forward to getting there and starting to put those things right. Uh, definitely, I think it's needed. I think once you um, you have a bad result on the weekend, it's it can go one or two ways. You can either have a game on the Tuesday and bounce back straight away or you can um, get it right on the training pitch. And I think, um, I think uh, having a week at the training ground this week will be... Uh, will be good and um, it'll be some good hard work and uh, tactical bits I'd imagine so um, I think it's needed and I think uh, we, uh, we need to be bang at it again for next week. As a senior pro how much responsibility do you take on lifting those younger players who might not have been through those kind of experiences before? Yeah you have to uh, you have to look after them um, on the pitch more so I think um, it's gone quite well for quite a lot of our young lads this year and um, I think when when the chips are down and they're making the odd mistake and the crowd's on them and maybe they've not experienced that before. So um, it's important you uh, you keep encouraging them to do the right things and, and get on to them and listen, happens to us all. Like The crowd weren't just moaning at them, it was all of us and thoroughly deserved. Um, but sometimes maybe the young lads have never really experienced that before. So it, it might take its toll. I'm not sure if you'd have to ask them, but maybe it does and you just got to keep encouraging them to do the right things. and. And, uh, and be brave. When you look at the bigger picture, home form has been so good and that's something you'll look to draw on again when you're back here in a fortnight as well, isn't it? 100%. Uh, we said it in there, uh, in the dressing room, our home form's been great and um, and we that's why we can't really put our finger on. We weren't really at it today because we were confident going into the game at home as well. And um, But listen, it, was, it wasn't to be and um, we've got a tough one away at Peterborough next week and then um, we're, we're back here and we need to uh, pick up some good results now because we get into the nitty gritty part of the season and we've worked too hard this year to to throw it all away now. So.